So I'm trying to help explain the way it feels to know I've been different all my life and then to later in life find out that it's because I'm autistic. And one analogy I thought of was how it's felt like since childhood and especially in childhood, like I was at a ballet every day and that everyone else had the program and that they were getting to see the storyline and understand what was going on in front of them. And then I thought, well, I've never been to a ballet. Let me look this up and see what kind of stuff is in the program. And in one forum, I found someone asking that question, what is in there? Is it narrated or is there some kind of storyline? And uh, I'm taking this person at their word. They said, no, it's not always. Uh, they might feel like the audience already knows the story, either from seeing it before or based on a, a different story they already know or that it's sufficiently self-explanatory. And that even makes more sense that <laughs> for, for me as an analogy, that that I'm thinking that it's it would be great if it's written in a book and a pamphlet and that everyone else has this pamphlet and then to find out that that it's not even necessarily in the pamphlet. It's just innate. They just they just get it naturally just by knowing the storyline already or by just viewing it that it'll be self-explanatory like if that doesn't epitomize the the struggle of being autistic in a neurotypical world then i don't know i'm gonna have i'm gonna struggle to come up with a better analogy than that